to my sisters and brothers and everyone in between from all walks of life from near and far i now call upon you and invite you to join the midnight society book club <laughs> 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 Forgive the theatrics. As an ex-theater kid, I gotta take it where I can. Let's talk about the book club. It is called the Midnight Society Book Club. I am finally starting my own. I'm so excited. You guys have been asking for it and you know, it's gotten to the point in my booktube career, whatever this is, I no longer have an excuse not to have my own book club. So this is it. We're starting. It's going to begin in January of 2023. I am so excited. So let me tell you about all the details. First of all, I want to make it very clear. This is a free book club for anyone and every one. Okay, you do not have to pay to join. You do not have to sign up for anything. It will be a monthly book club. Read the book with me for that month. Join me on my channel for a live show at the end of the month and we'll all talk about it together. The types of books that I want to read are just essentially my taste in books, which is thriller, horror, and if I can find things with like a feminist twist to them, then that as well. You may be wondering about the name of this book club. Here's the thing. I love Are You Afraid of the Dark? And I know I'm not alone in this. I know you guys love Are You Afraid of the Dark too. It has that sense of nostalgia for me. It brings back those feelings of being scared at night, watching Nick at Night at 8 p.m. on Friday night when my parents were out bowling in Michigan. I'm really painting a picture for you here. That's just kind of the vibe that I want this to be about. I want us to be a society. We lurk in the dark, we come together, and no one else knows. Except for every single person who watches this video. But other than that, nobody else knows. It's our own secret. <laughs> we gather together and we read these books and submit them for the approval of the Midnight Society. Similarly to Kayla from Books and Lala, I'm also going to be skipping the month of December this year and moving on forward just because I feel like it's a little bit too chaotic. Every month I will invite at least one other person to join me on my channel to discuss the book on the live show and I hope you will join us there and together cumulatively we will submit it to the Midnight Society and either approve it or deny it. I also have an Instagram set up for this, and it is called The Midnight Society Book Club. So I've got that set up. Follow me over there. That is where I'm going to post what the books are. If you miss my video for it and you just want to reference and check what's the book this month, you can check over there. You guys can also tag The Midnight Society Book Club in your pictures as you're reading them. I'll reshare it out there. That's the space that we're going to go to talk about these books as we're reading them as opposed to in the live show. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. I will link that down below in the description so you can just go ahead and click on that and head on over to Instagram. Make sure you are following that so you can keep up to date with all of the information. That being said, I have already chosen the first three months of books, so I'm also going to announce those in this video, as well as my co-hosts who will be joining me for those three months. Starting in January, we are going to be reading Mother Thing by Ainsley Hogarth. I have had this book on my radar for so long that I think it's just time to read it. It seems perfect for this book club. And from what I understand, this is a darkly funny domestic horror book following a woman who must take drastic measures to save herself and her husband from the vengeful spirit of her mother-in-law. Does it not sound perfect? From what I've heard, this is a little bit towards the literary side, so I'm not expecting it to be like straight up horror. I'm expecting it to have things to say though, so I hope that we get that from this book. And my co-host for January is going to be none other than Gabby from Gabby Reads. I am so excited to have Gabby on my channel. If you don't know who Gabby is, 
immediately go follow her channel at Gabby Raids. She is just one of the sweetest people. She has such a huge heart and really great creative content. Love watching her channel. So I'm very excited to have her join me over on mine. Let's talk about our February pick. We are going to be reading Plastic Monsters by Daniel J. Volk. This is a horror book that I picked up a while ago that I've also been really meaning to get to. So let me tell you a little bit what this is about. We're following Pamela Rose. She is obsessed with beauty. She is aging and she spends all of her time and almost every dollar she has to fight against nature and keep herself looking youthful and beautiful. When a coworker comes to work with a brand new boob job, it's the last thread. She cracks. We're also following a doctor who just got out of prison. Now, I don't know what he was in prison for, but it says he made art from flesh and plastic. So was he a plastic surgeon? Is he Ed Gein? I don't know. But he's not done making art, but he has to find the perfect patient. And I believe Pam is going to be that person for him. And he's going to create a monster. I hope this has some kind of Frankenstein references because that's what I'm getting. I also hope that it's going to talk about beauty standards for women and how we kill ourselves to continue to stay young and beautiful. For February, my co-host who is joining me is going to be Beth from over at Beth's All Booked. Beth is one of my closest friends that I've met in the book community. Love her so much. She's sassy. She's Southern. She tells it like it is. And I think she's going to tell this how it is too. So I'm really excited to read this with her. And again, having her join me over on my channel. Now let's talk about March. For the month of March, I am going to be reading The Drift by CJ Tudor. This is going to be her newest release. I believe it comes out in January. I'm gonna have a really hard time not reading it until March, I'll tell you that right now. But I wanna make sure you guys have enough time to get the book. So I'll try to at least pick books that have been out for a month or so. CJ Tudor, I love her writing. I call her the Diane Sawyer of thriller authors because she's just super poised and she so carefully threads her words and her storylines through. She normally has a little bit of kind of is it or is it not paranormal kind of drenched in between but she's not afraid to talk about things like religion and other aspects that play into her horror judging based on the description it's gonna be perfect for me it's isolation it's snow it's some kind of pandemic or virus that's going around and we're following three different people as they try to escape this virus and survive this snowstorm and keep their lives. So I think it's going to be high stakes. I think it's going to be fast paced. And knowing CJ Tudor, it's also going to have something to say. I can't wait for this one. And my guest for March is going to be Ashley from Ashley's Little Library. Ashley is another good friend of mine from the book community. We've collaborated on a lot of things together. And I'm so happy to have her over on my channel. She also reads a lot of horror and the thing I really admire about Ashley is that she doesn't leave out any details in her videos. She always makes sure that you feel accepted in her channel. If you don't know something or know what she's talking about, she'll explain it to you. If you don't know a literary term or a book thing, she always makes sure that she's catering to people and making them feel welcome. And so I love that about her channel. Again, all of these women, if you don't follow them, go follow them now. <laughs> I will link them down below in the description as well. And that's it. That is my new book club that I'm starting in January. I can't wait. I'm very excited for this. I think it's going to be so much fun and I really hope you will join me. Let me know down in the description box below if I forgot anything, if you have any questions. Uh, don't forget to go follow me over on Instagram. And that's going to be it for me today, y'all. Don't forget to read Riley and I will see you soon.